In this video, we are going to see one of the in-text to question which is taken from 12th NCRT Chemistry Lesson 2 Electrochemistry. The question is, uh, if a current of 0.5 ampere flows through a metallic wire for two hours, then how many electrons would flow through the wire? The givens are current and the time. The current value is 0.5 ampere. Here we can note down the 0.5 value as 1 by 2. So, I is equal to 1 by 2 ampere and then time is given uh, in hours. Here we have to convert hours into seconds. So, the value of time is equal to 2 into 3600 seconds. The relation between Q, I and T is equal to Q is equal to I into T. Substituting I and T values in this equation, we will get Q value as 3600 coulombs. We know that one farad of electricity contains a negative number of electrons. One farad is equal to 96,500 coulombs contains 6.02 into 10 to the power of 23 electrons. So from this, we can calculate one coulomb of electricity will contain uh, 6.02 into 20 to the power of 23 by 96,500 electrons. In this wire, uh, 3,600 coulomb uh, is passing. And so here, for 3,600 coulombs, how many electrons are flowing through the wire? We have to calculate. So multiplying this value, uh, by 3600 you will get the answer here uh, i'm cancelling 36 by 965 approximate values so approximately it gives 1 by 26 here denominator is 2 decimal and numerator is 1 decimal so convert this numerator into two decimal value by multiplying 10 to the power of minus that is 60.2 into 10 to the power of minus 1 by 26 into 10 to the power of 23 now cancelling these values we will get 2.2 uh, into 10 to the power of 23 so, 2.2 into 10 to the power 22 electrons are flowing through the wire uh, during this condition. That is uh, current of 0.5 ampere at uh, two hour, for 2 hours. So, 2.2 into 10 to the power of 22 electrons is the correct answer. Thank you.